Hi everybody, we're playing Warframe. Today we're going to take a look at the Stalker's Despair weapon. This is a weapon that drops from the Stalker or the Shadow Stalker. A set of throwing knives with micronic edges used by the Stalker. They're very, very sharp. And it's a great uh, stealth weapon. Really, it drops. Really, it drops by chance. Um, it's only got a 5.5% chance to drop from the Stalker. And it's even lower for Shadow Stalker at 2.7% chance. Excellent work. We'll interrogate the captive back at base. Your part is done here. And you have to have the Stalker spawn into your mission as well, so not really something you can really farm for. Uh, it's really just a chance weapon. If it drops, you're extremely lucky. Can increase the chances of having stalkers spawn in by killing bosses in assassination missions. Shadow stalkers spawning into this mission here. Lucky for me, he dropped the despair blueprint. Only a 2.7% chance. So I'm going to go and craft this one now and see what it can do. You can see it takes regular uh, resource types. No surprises there. Takes 12 hours to build. Collect it and equip it and see what it does. As I said before, this is a silent weapon, so it's good for stealthing. Secondary. I'm going to put some basic mods on it when I start. You see the tiny little daggers from the hands. So this weapon does primarily puncture damage. So I'm going to put a puncture mod on here. And I'll put a straight damage mod as well, just to start with. Okay. Well put together, operator. Now get out there and cut down the and make the Lotus proud. We'll go to Palace, which is an exterminate mission. Easy grenade mission. Now the weapon does have a bit of an arc over a distance, so we'll need to aim it properly. Probably better on short or medium range. Stay I can stop that There's alarm. Keep it silent. Watch yourself. Grenier are on the way.
Also, I might need to lead the target a little bit. Though it seems very much like a bow, like it's not going to alert anybody as you do your mission and be a benefit. You can get a mod called Concealed Explosives, which is a thrown exclusive, and that will give you an 80% chance to explode throwing daggers. I might try that in another video. Weapon seems pretty lethal, even at very low levels. I'm going to do a video later on on how this weapon performs at a higher level, with a few formers in it, a proper build. Well done. Now get to extraction. You can throw the daggers while you're in the air, which is nice. Guys, that's the end of this episode. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked it, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.